Hi everyone, Pastor Joe. Happy Thanksgiving. We uh, we all have so much to give thanks for. Uh, may have been a wonderful year, may have been a challenging year, but regardless, we have so many blessings in our lives to give thanks to God. And I think one of the questions we ask, uh, my wife and I were talking last night, is you know who do you give thanks to? It's one thing to be thankful, but uh, who am I thankful to? And I'm thankful to God for my freedom, for my wife, for my children, for our church, for all the blessings that God has provided for us this year and uh, the opportunity to, to help so many other people. I think those are all, that's just a small list of things that uh, that we're thankful for thankful for the hope that we have in Christ. And uh, tonight we're going to be having a special Thanksgiving service, really to kind of get our heads going in the right way, because Thursday the chaos ensues. And uh, yes, I certainly hope that you uh, you spend time sharing what you're thankful for and that you actually pray together at the table. But I also know the insanity of the preparations, the food and football, and you know those are all important, but that's kind of missing the point uh, to actually take time. So tonight at 6.30, we'll be having a special Thanksgiving service to just spend time with God and, and actually to make it what God's intended for it to be. Also at the donation station, we're collecting blankets and, and warm socks that uh, we give away to the homeless every year. This is an ongoing project. Uh, obviously, they don't have anywhere to keep them, so they use them and they get left or they get wet or whatever. So it's 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 just an ongoing process. So your giving to that is blessing uh, a lot of people that are in need that uh, that are on the street. We thank you for that. Uh, also, this weekend, I'll be speaking uh, on prayer, and we're going to be introducing our new prayer walk, uh, a new prayer app that we're going to introduce to you, and praying for our missionaries. In fact, the prayer walk it actually is right where our Christmas trees are, so if you want to stop and p pick up a Christmas tree, uh, all that money goes back to help missions. But I don't know if you can see my cell phone. Uh, most of you probably have a little better technology, but this is my, this is my hot phone, all right? This... This is my, it's kind of like what the White House has, but this is my direct cell phone to Mike Matheny, who is the manager of the St. Louis Cardinals. So when I need to tell Mike something, explain what he's doing wrong and how to get things on track, I, I can call Mike. I can only wish that this phone actually worked, but I don't have a hotline to Mike. But I have something better than that. I have a hotline to the creator of the universe. And that's what we're talking about this week from Matthew 26 is about the fact that I actually have a way to communicate directly with God, to talk to him, and to listen to him. And so read Matthew 26. Have a great Thanksgiving. I love being your pastor. And I'll see you this weekend.